Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Listen, beloved, you can learn that. That's short, right? That's not a whole lot of scripture. Let's dig into it, right? You go to Matthew uh, 6, starting at verse 9. You need to commit this prayer to memory so you can have it as you move through your day, right? And the way you want to do it is, it, it, is listen to the words, right? Because they all mean something. Right. The Lord Jesus tell us after this man, therefore, pray ye. Right. And he was telling them, don't be like the, the uh, hypocrites with these long speeches and, you know, praying for just 15 minutes about whatever the case may be. Because he said, what you doing that for? Your heavenly father already know what you have need of before you ask him. That's good God almighty. Right. You don't need to be asking him. He know what you got need of. Right. And so the first thing you need to do is seek the kingdom of heaven and its righteousness and all good things will be added on to you. But let's dig into this, right? Because the Lord told you, not me, I'm not telling you this. He said right here in verse uh, 6, 9, after this manner, therefore pray ye, right? Telling you, I'm showing you. Our Father, which art in heaven, right? Our, right? Our. Halo, hallowed, H-A-L-L-O-W-E-D, be thy name. All right, so I, I, my opinion on the word myself is that the name of the Lord has been hallowed, right? Meaning taken in vain, right? That's my interpretation. Thy kingdom come. We want the kingdom of heaven to be on earth. Yes, we want to live in rest, peace, tranquility suffer our lives and then dream of this place after the fact we want to have heaven on earth okay and so thy will be done in earth so those that will do the will of my father he is my brother sister mother right this is the lord jesus said that's why it's our father right and so we want heaven on earth Thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day, please, Lord. I pray daily to have another one to minister on to my children, to try to create a better world for them so that they can have their children, right? Because this is not a guaranteed thing, especially for you if you believe in the scriptures because the Lord Jesus Christ coming back and his wrath. Look, you need to fear the wrath of the Lamb. Whatever they're telling you about the Lord Jesus, if you, <coughs> look, this soft, cuddly, cute teddy bear that accept you for anything, that's not in the scripture. Sorry to tell you. He don't love you however you are. In the old time, it was hate involved. And in the New Testament, there was hate involved, right? In the book of Revelations, the deeds of the Nicolaitans, the Lord Jesus Christ, hates. So Jesus, Lord Jesus, can hate. It's in the scripture, beloved. Now, uh, heaven on earth, give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts. Forgive us for our sins as we forgive others, right? That's the main point, right? We forgive them for our debts, but you know, we have to forgive others. Because the Lord Jesus said, if you're not going to forgive, why would good God Almighty forgive you? Okay? And lead us not into temptation. Remember, God can put a evil spirit on you. We got so many cases. Saul, you, you, you know what I'm saying? Not, yeah, 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 Saul. It was with King David, right? He was getting, he got out of the way. But they was already told to the children of Israel when they demanded the king that the ways of a king were the ways of men. And I had given you all you needed, but you want a king because all those other nations need kings? 
And so uh, he gave it to him. And like I said, the Lord could put an evil spirit on you. So look, you got to pray, Lord, don't protect me. Don't tempt me, right? Because my flesh is weak. My spirit willing, but my flesh weak, right? And the kingdom is God's. All power is God's. And all glory and all things we do is God's, beloved. Commit the Lord's prayer to memory.